Alverde insecticide, with its active ingredient metaflumazone, represents a new class of chemistry in insecticides. This video will help you recognize insect symptoms when scouting fields treated with Alverde. In these trials, leaves have been treated with label rates of Alverde. A larva is placed on each leaf, and the results are tracked over four days. Untreated leaves with larvae at the same instar are used for comparison. Because the active ingredient in Alverde must be ingested to be effective, insects must feed on a small amount of treated foliage. Feeding soon stops, however, and impact on the crop is minimal. Here a beet armyworm at one day after treatment with Alverde has stopped feeding and is showing signs of the reduced movement and feeding called terminal paralysis characteristic of this insecticide. In contrast, the larva on the untreated leaf continues to feed extensively, molt and grow. It remains its normal color. At two days, the Alverde treated larva is alive but is not feeding. Reaction to stimulus is much slower. The difference in size between treated and untreated larvae is becoming obvious. Three days after consuming Alverde, black spots are visible on a treated larva. It is smaller than at the time of treatment, a clear sign of dehydration. The untreated larva continues to grow and molt. By four days, mortality is imminent. Dehydration continues to shrink the larva and terminal paralysis is fully evident. In contrast, the untreated larva has consumed its entire leaf and is looking for more. As seen here, Virtually all beet armyworm feeding ceases within the first day of Alverde consumption, with mortality occurring three to four days later. Feeding damage to the crop is minimal, and control is equal to or better than current standards. Similar effects are seen on southern armyworm, but with mortality typically occurring more quickly. These larvae are shown one day after Alverde treatment. At two days, Alverde-treated larvae already show advanced stages of terminal paralysis. Untreated larvae continue growing normally. By three days, treated southern armyworm are desiccating and nearly dead. At four days, terminal paralysis and mortality of treated larvae is complete. Untreated larvae have molted several times and are in late instars. The symptoms of Alverde activity are easily recognized. Treated insects stop feeding almost immediately as they undergo terminal paralysis and dehydration. They do not grow, may shrink in size, and display abnormal coloration. Typically, mortality results within three to four days, depending on species and weather conditions.